Hi, welcome to J-West Engineering. Today I'm going to show you how to change the adjustable shift throw on the in-shift performance shifter. In order to make this adjustment, first the shifter has to be removed from the car. Either before or after we remove the shifter from the car, the upper stake also has to be removed. We use a 4mm Allen wrench, loosen up the set screws and remove that upper stake. Then we need to remove the internal shaft that goes through the shifter. Luckily, none of the springs inside of the shifter are affected by this change. It's just a single bolt that has to be removed. Use a five millimeter Allen wrench, go inside the housing, loosen, and then remove that bolt. Now, Instead of trying to fish it out of there, there's a schnorr washer under there that you don't want to go falling and rolling across the floor. You can flip it over, use the other end of your Allen wrench, and push it out into your hand. That keeps it all together. Now that the bolt is out, you shove the shaft down and out the bottom of the shifter. You can see how it slides down through that opening, doesn't disturb any of the springs. We have a thrust washer on each side and a bearing that goes through the shaft. And the way this works is we have two holes bored through the shaft, and as you noticed before, two sets of holes in the shifter. By using two sets of holes in each, we don't have to change the height of the stick when we change the throw. All we do is change the fulcrum by moving the bushings and the bolt from the upper to the lower as needed. If we were to move the stick up and down, we change the placement of the bushing here in the cup in the car and the things just wouldn't work. So there's two holes. The lower hole is how the shifters are delivered. That's 20% throw reduction. The upper hole is approximately 33% throw reduction. So we're changing from the 20% as delivered. We're gonna move the bushing up to the 33%. So bushing on top, thrust washer on each side. Then this part's a little bit tricky, but not too bad. Take the shaft and carefully drop the shift shaft in there. I'll do it poorly a couple times so you don't feel bad when you can't do it the first time. <laughs> Push it on up and when it's aligned properly, you'll be able to see through both holes because they'll both be aligned. Take the bolt, line it up with the upper hole where the bushing now rests. Tighten that down and check for a snug movement. It's a good idea to put Loctite on the back side the way I choose to do this. So I usually back off the threads and drop a drop a lock tight down on the back side on the threads into the hole and then screw it down. Now our throw has been changed. Put the shifter back in the car. Enjoy your adjustment.